<laughs> How are you, Miss Ann? I'm good. Hey. I feel good. I see that smile got a little bigger from yesterday. Come on. Every Tell day me. is better. Every day, why? Every day is better. Every day is better. You can say that again. Every day is better. Come on. All right, so can the body heal? Yes. All right, talk to me. What's going down? So you traveled up from San Francisco? Yes. Down, technically? Yeah. Down, all right. And um, tell me. So it's for me to eventually find you, or rather through my mom find you, um, thankfully, it was of a failed attempt to have treatment mm. um, elsewhere mm. and years of pain, including that, mm. that was that were unresolvable, mm. or either would relieve for a moment, for a short period of time, and then get back to, again, intense pain. Mm. So, finally met you, and started, talked it over, did um, scanning, mm -hmm. and, and... Films. Basically films, and you were able to accept me as a patient, and, and I came back. Um, from San Francisco a couple of weeks after or rather scheduled treatment came back yeah you you wanted to start and I said hey let you know let's let's see what we can do as far as some level of commitment because you really need you need care yes it's not an overnight process correct right and it's hard because you're like well I want to I want to give you an adjustment right but yes. we know that there's more it's deeper than that there's more than that you yeah can just treat within a day this, correct. this needs a course of treatment factual time. yes so yeah that compared to well, now knowing what to do and what's going on internally, mm. it's I've noticed such incredible difference from mm. the time I started, which was last week on mm. the fourth, mm. March fourth, to today. See, uh, the twelfth. Yes. It's been today. a week, week and a day. Yeah. Exactly. And I actually noticed it within the third or fourth day wow. of treatment, twice a day. And so lower back pain came in Thursday. I was just like, give me a hug. This Aww. is awesome. I'm not in pain. And I got up in the middle of the night, Wednesday night, thinking mm. something's not right. I'm not using pillows to cost, to cost my I legs. remember, and, I remember. Yeah, and I was just amazed. Yeah. It was, it was, I didn't know how to feel because being in pain for so long, mm. you don't know how to feel not in pain. It, become, it becomes like a bag that you carry. Yeah. And you're always, you, you know, you always have that bag, that sweater, you always have it with you. Yeah. And then you don't have, you're like, where's my bag? You know, where's, where's my bag of pain, <laughs> right? You came in and you said, um, you, usually it feels like lead or something, yeah, right? It feels yeah. like lead in your foot yeah. when you lift it up. And so you're like, I can lift my foot up yeah. and there's no no issue there, yeah. right? Yeah, and the back also it feels so heavy, like oh. you're carrying the weight on the world on your lower back. Mm. And even bending, stretching, it's become so much easier. So You think that could weigh on the way somebody feels about life in general? Most definitely. Most definitely. Yeah. Some people yeah. are carrying around a weight, a burden, yes. right? Yes. The the world on their shoulders. Yes. And others are very light and easy to be around, you know. Hey Anne, what do you do in your laundry? I'll be right over ready, you know, they just want to be around you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Amazing. So the body can heal. The body can heal. Yeah. Most definitely. It can now, heal. does it take work? Oh yeah. Oh, a lot. It does. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, and you know, you start noticing, uh, you start becoming conscious of what what you're doing, mm. what what you, how you're posturing yourself, how you're sleeping, mm. um, even sitting, watching TV. You kind of have to adjust yourself. Like, okay, I'm slouching. Mm. Or, like today, when I was working, I, I was just thinking, okay, economics. Yeah. You know, yeah. working on those shoulders. Yeah. Exactly. There's so much intensity back there. So. Yeah, you you feeling things you didn't feel before. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. And uh, and how is the numbness in the hand? Numbness in the hand almost all subsided. Wow. Almost all gone. Wow. And then the other issue was pain down the left mm. leg mm -hmm. um, laterally. Mm. So that on the leg, completely gone. The only pain that's residual is on the the foot, the foot. Yeah. and we're working and we're working and we're working speaking of which <laughs> are you ready <laughs> yes all right let's roll come on over we're gonna lay face up we're gonna trade places here so go ahead and lay on your back here i'm excited to get started and uh face up please face up my right dear i want to start with that lower extremity See, turning like this was a problem she's now she's now, now she's just back. showing off she she's just that's what it is now she said this she said exciting. i'm turning like yeah it, it is exciting when you actually can be in your body, right? And not trying to get out of your body, you know? 
Hands here. You want me to take the tissue? Here, I got oh, you. No. Okay, okay. So uh, hands to the side, and we're gonna go ahead and pull your legs to the right. Pull, pull, pull. So first thing is we're checking those low back muscles. Pull, and because she's been out of alignment for so long, the quadratus lumborum, these big muscles back here that support the spine, are not firing properly. We're gonna test the left side. So go ahead and pull your legs to the left and stand. Pull, pull, pull. And that one's firing. So tighten your abs. Come on up. We're gonna lay face down now, please. We're gonna start with the right side. And you slide it all the way this way, my dear. Hips relaxed, shoulders relaxed. We're gonna dig into this QL. And you're just gonna breathe. Let me hear a nice big breath. Again, breathe. Now, what would you say has been the worst prior to coming in? Was it the lower back pain, the neck, the, the numbness and tingling? What was the worst thing that really made you say, oh my gosh, I gotta do something. So the lower back pain, mm. that was getting worse because now I was referring pain down the leg. Oh. So of course that's associated, something's not working right. Something's not it was, right. It wasn't a leg injury. Correct. Something's not right. You knew, yeah. you knew instinctively it was deeper than just a small issue. Exactly. Yeah. And then after an incident, um, uh, whiplash or rather concussion mm. from an accident on the neck mm. then that those two things push you to push me to I gotta do something about this sooner than later understood breathe in now and out so we're holding the glute max down you relax breathe uh, no no breath sorry breathe all the way out and then cut the breath no help where my hands on her sacrum breathe in relax now we're counter straining the glute max, giving her quads a little stretch, a little motion into the toes, foot relaxedness, and all the way. There we go. And now, breathe in and out. Foot relaxed here. Okay. And then we're going to lay on our back in this hand. So we're doing the tune up before the alignment. Hips relaxed. We're going to bring this one out here. We're on the right side today. There we go. We're going to pull this hand right here. Breathe. And out. Uh, going to lean over you to get some leverage here. Go. See, it's the first time. Mm. Pressure, um, pressure on this is not as intense as it was on this side. Mm -hmm. So the left side was just... Just holding. Yeah. It's amazing, isn't it, as the body starts to unwind. Yeah. Put your hands right here, one on top of the other. Breathe in. And out. So all of this is a compensation to the lower back being out of alignment for so long. I'm only like 200 pounds, so it shouldn't be too heavy. <laughs> Breathe deep. And out. So, a lot of docs don't do this type of rehab where they're correcting the muscular imbalances too. I've just found that, especially with these complex cases, that um, we just get better that much faster because it's like unwinding. You know those old telephones? Yeah. And you know how sometimes they get all twisted up, and the, you know you kind of have to just stop and just hold it and let it unravel. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like doing that. It lets you unravel a little bit smoother and faster. Foot relaxed. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to retest. So legs to your right, hands off. Pull your legs to the right, pull, pull, pull. She does not want to lose that one again. <laughs> pull to the left. Beautiful. Stay there. I'm just going to move the table a little bit. And then leg relax, straighten it out. You push up with your foot. Push, push, push. Nice and strong. Okay, we're going to lift up here. Straighten your leg. Nice and strong. Push up. Beautiful push. And it's holding really, really strong today. So stay there and take a breath in while I look at your charts. Beautiful. And we're going to breathe in nice and deep. Keep your hands right there. Big breath. Head relaxed. Now, when Ann first came in, oh, honestly, was not really moving, right? Mm -hmm. You remember that? Yes. 
a week ago. Yeah. Saw something, tighten those abs. Sit up this way, we're just gonna do a little pop quiz in her core. Go down, come back up. She's not even phased, look at this, go down. Now this is the girl that came in with low back pain, leg numb, chest up, here we go. We're gonna just get some reciprocal inhibition going, toes up, hands out like so. This is Navasana, say Navasana. Navasana. Good, it's a great distractor. <laughs> chest up, breathe in, and out. Now as she's here, all her abs are working really hard, yes? Yes. Her low back muscles are gonna shut off as soon as we let her abs rest. Breathe, 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 breathe. And out, cross your arms, keep holding, hold yourself, don't use me, head forward, breathe, breathe, breathe. Huge, beautiful, beautiful motion there, let your head go. She still wants to work out. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna come on your side this way. Yes, man. In the way like so, hips relax. Shoulders right, yeah, exactly. You breathe. Big breath. Hand out, shoulders loose. Wow. That also wasn't moving like that, right? Come on over this way, everybody. How would you describe the feeling of having a solid, crisp, clean adjustment versus when you came in and it was like, you know, it wouldn't really move? Fluidity. Fluidity. Hips relax. Things are moving in motion and safe. That's how I feel. Wow. How I'm feeling. Shoulders loose. Right there. Big release. We're going to go for a bonus. We're going to stand up here. And we're going to stand up all the way. Shoulders relaxed. These were so stiff when you came in. You remember? Yes. Oh my gosh, and she's even, she's even standing up more straight, aren't you? Have you looked in the mirror? Oh, she's yeah. literally standing up more straight than when she came in. Head down, hands on top of mine. Interlock your fingers, squeeze down, breathe. Fall back, fall, fall, fall. Beautiful, see there? Nice little stretch. She was so much more stiff when she first came in. It's unreal, breathe. And now we couldn't do this. <laughs> All right, so now, little love squeeze. Now we're gonna get her set up on traction. Are you ready? Yes. All right, let's gather your belongings. Let's roll over there. Come on, remember? 